Gadgets YouTube channel. Today we'll be doing a Samsung S8 Plus device teardown. Now first we'll start by powering off the device. And then we will use our CPB heating pad to warm the back of the device to make the adhesive easier to remove. At 60 degrees Celsius it typically takes maybe four to six minutes. Now we'll use our iFlex opening tool to get under the back and loosen it from the phone. And you do need to be careful towards the top of the device right here to not go too deep so as not to cut the Touch ID Flex cable. Now that the back is removed, we have 15 screws, uh, size Phillips triple zero, that need to be removed. Now using blunt headed tweezers, I'll just put this in a little notch in the plastic and twist to lift up the back cover and NFC coil. And same goes for the loudspeaker. Just put in the notch and twist to lift it up. Using a nylon spudger, we will disconnect the front camera and iris scanner here, just again with a little twist of the hand. And next to disconnect the battery. Here's the LCD connector and an antenna and these two wire cables down towards the bottom, which you do need to be careful when removing to not use too much force because it is possible to break off the receiver on the daughter board for those cables. So again, please be careful. And now to remove the board, first we'll need to take out the SIM tray. So just using sharp nose tweezers, you can poke down in that hole to get it started. Now the last step before pulling up the main board will be to remove the volume flex, again with a nylon spudger. And then we can go ahead with the main board removal, making sure all the flex cables are pulled out of the way so they don't get caught. Last step before removing the main board is to disconnect the daughter board connector here, again with a nylon spudger and just a light twist. Next is the rear camera. Once you disconnect the flex cable, you can carefully use some tweezers to work under the plastic guard and then twist and wiggle to loosen the camera. Now to remove the daughter board, we have a few more screws to get out, and the headphone jack is still connected, but we will disconnect that shortly. To start getting it removed, just lightly pull and tug gently, 
to get the board components out. And then with a nylon spudger, we will disconnect the audio jack. Now using light pressure, you can pull up and to the right using a nylon spudger to move the flex out of the way. It can be a little awkward with the audio jack still in there, but I found that that's the easiest way to get both components out. Now to remove some of the smaller components, the vibrator first. We will use dull headed tweezers to wiggle and twist your way under the vibrator and then lift it up. Next will be the ear speaker, which there's a little nook. You can work your dull tweezers in and again, twist and gently pull it up. The adhesive is quite strong, so it might take some time. And then we have the proximity sensor and flash, which comes up fairly easily under that metal plate. Now that completes the teardown or disassembly of the S8 Plus. All components have been removed.